Hello, welcome back to Poker Collection. How are you guys today? I hope you're doing well. I'm back with the Hisuian Zoroark V-Star Premium Collection. A bit of a mouthful, but it's a big one. It's got a lot of stuff going on, so let's just get straight into it. Um, so where do I start with this? So we've got we've got the Zoroark Hisuian version, obviously, um, the Fallout V along with the V-Star, and then the V-Star massive oversized card, a massive coin as well, of Hisuian Zoroark and then a pin of V-Star token and I believe six booster packs as well to boot. So really cool, really awesome stuff and you can check out a closer Im a close up image of, of this on my Facebook page so feel free to navigate your way through my website pokerson.com and you'll find yourself there. Nothing to buy, just things to see and things to read I guess if you want to keep up with me on social media. I'm on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, TikTok, um, doing that whole thing where I can in between being a parent. Um, massive shout out to my friends at Banter Toys and Collectibles. I have been working with them for 13 plus years and we're coming up to 14 years of Poker Collection this year. So I've been working with them since the very, very early days when poker tubing was very, very very small and different, completely different, and I'm so glad, you know, I sort of lived through the early stages because things have shifted obviously, but it's just so awesome to be able to work with such a great group, group of people, people are people are friends now as well, um, nearly 15 years in, it's crazy, it's crazy isn't it, I just still can't believe it's been that long doesn't feel like it sometimes because I've just sort of carried on it's just one linear timeline but when you split it up into years of course you know time does pass and it's just crazy how much time has passed so you know bit of a bit of a nice reminiscence there so thanks to banter you guys rock I love you guys a lot um, okay so putting these boots back together I'll give you guys a look I'm just deconstructing everything so I can show you everything without the big clunkiness of the box that's here I'm gonna keep shaking the camera all right first of all first up first we have I said first twice um, we have this epic looking pin it's got like a two layer two layer thing to it and it's so sorry the focus is so bad here hello there yeah um, the focus is so bad but it's so clunky that it's got two of these <laughs> pins because it's not going to be able to be held by one. But how amazing does that look? It's cool, right? That looks awesome. Really, really cool. Um, I really need to find one of those pin boards so I can, you know, put all my pins like there nicely displayed. I need to find them. Um, of course, we've got a V-Star token. Love a V-Star token. Got to have them. Um, all right, onto the promo card. So we've got this one, which is number 297. Looking really cool. Nice texture there. Weird centering, but I think the Sword and Shield was kind of marred. The whole series was marred by that kind of kind of weirdness, but I love the cards anyway. There's a coin. Very sparkly. Very sparkly. Really nice though. And then we've got the V-Star promo, which is promo 298. Really nice colouring on the V-Stars, actually. Actually, having the V-Stars was a really good prelude to... I guess moving to Scarlet and Violet and having the silver borders because it's very similar. Um, obviously a bit more whiter, but really nice all the same. And then we've got the full size version there as well. And of course, can't have a collector's box without a TCG code card. So I'm going to redeem that later on myself. So what booster packs do we have? We've got Chilling Rain, Evolving Skies. <laughs> yes, I don't think I'm going to get the Gyarados, but honestly, all I really want at this point is the Gyarados from this set, because or at least one of them, there's a few. They've got Fusion Strike, Astral Radiance, and then two Lost Origin. But yeah, I really want to open more Evolving Skies, but I should have bought more than I actually did. And to be honest, I think I'm going to have to... Anything that involves Eevee in the future, I'm just going to have to buy loads of, because it's clear that these sets just go crazy afterwards, and I just really want to open more of those packs, and I just want more Gyarados in my life, for my Gyarados collection, you know? I suppose I can stick to singles, but some you know it's not as fun when you can when you can pull it as well. All right, so we've got Crab Abominable, Spiral Energy, Honey, Ralts, Heracross, Cast Form, Sphere, Hatena, Sobble, 
Oh, Blissey V! Nice to kick off that video, that's awesome. I approve. Actually, it's been so long since I've opened Slim Line that I forgot what I need to Alright, Evolving Skies. <laughs> I'm probably going to dud again. I was, I'm never good with a single packs. Alright, i got Rescue Carrier, Aroma Lady, Boldor, Bagon, Litlio, got Lotan, Teddy Ursa, Cryogonal, Flaffy Reverse, and an Ampharos had evolved! Okay, at least we had a nice instant evolution there. Alright, Fusion Strike now. Alright, Bugcatcher, Wigglytuff, Phalanx, this is Astral Radiance now, Skarmory, sorry, no, what pack was this? <laughs> Fusion Strike, Skarmory, uh, Jinx, Mantine, my memory, Grubbin, Rotom, a Slagoo, Reverse, and a Blissey! Very Blissey themed today. Alright, now's Astral Radiance, got a bit ahead of myself there. So we have a Cricketoon, Bishop, Choi, Ooh, Nicket, Petalil, Bergmite, Hippopotas, Cyndaquil, Dark Patch, and Whoa, Heatran V. Nice. That's two Vs. I approve. I think I've got that one. Alright, last last up. Two packs of Lost Origin. Origin. Okay, so we have a drain damage pump, not drainage pump, no. Uh, <laughs> Ambipom, a Lampant, Litwick, Jinx, Pikachu, Machop, Snova, Silcoon Reverse, and a Parasect. Okay, final pack. Let's see if there's any last pack magic in this. Oh. Okay, so we have a Cascoon, a Lost Vacuum, oh gosh, what was that? Relicanth, a Meditite, Horsey, Sea Dot, Tynamo, Wormpole, oh, Volo Reverse, don't remember this one, and it's a Polyrath Rare. Oh well, that's all good. I think I need to open still actually a bit more Lost Origin because there's a few cards I didn't recognise there, so that is good. Um, what do you guys reckon? What do you guys think of the pulls? Have you how's your evolving skies journey? Are you guys collecting that set? Did you do really well with that? Did you get Gyarados? Let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you guys very soon. Take care. <laughs> Bye.